Okay, so we're back. <laughs> Almost spring, right? Is it spring? I don't know. Feels like it. We came in last night again in the dark. Uh, it was a little bit scary. I There's some stuff in the woods that I don't understand how it got there, you know. And everything just gets scary in the dark. Yeah. Yeah, we hiked on a trail and then just shoof, out in the woods. Found this and found this spot. What's a little bit crazy about it is there's so many trees here. There's n this is not an obvious camp spot. And at the same tree that I was gonna set up my tarp, there's already a line, like paracord. This is not mine. Yeah. Yeah, you see, it's even a fire place here. That's so weird that we can walk through this forest in the dark. And just set up at the exact same tree as someone else. That's kind of freaky. Because <laughs> it's not more flat over there than anywhere else. There's trees everywhere to set up your tarp. I fire like this you can do anywhere. They left some plastic. It's not good. We'll bring it, we'll throw it away in the trash can, and we do our part. <laughs> it's always fun to wake up and see, like in the morning, where did you set up your camp in the dark? <laughs> you never really know what you're laying on or what's, what's next to you. You can look over like... 10 meters and see like, oh, I should have camped there. It's perfect over there. But yeah, this was good enough. Yeah, I could see pretty pretty well because of the moonshine. Uh, in this forest, you're not allowed to keep your dog off leash. So she's going to stay on. I wanted to make a little fire, make some coffee. But it's super wet. It was raining last night. I'm gonna make a fire later, but I think the effort required is <laughs> too high right now. So, and we're moving on. Yeah, we're gonna head towards the lake. I don't know if it's gonna rain or not. There's, uh, there's a pretty big chance it's gonna rain. What is it? Oh. <laughs> That's an egg shell. I mean, <laughs> what happened here? <laughs> okay, <laughs> we've we'll been walking for some time, not long at all. <laughs> I don't know if you can see the sky. It is not looking good at all. But it, it's shifting between sun and hail, which was good, so we didn't get wet. I don't think we're gonna be that lucky anymore. Those clouds does not look, that's trouble. <laughs> so 
perhaps we're gonna we should be very close to the lake. I'm gonna hurry up we're gonna go fast and then we set up the tarp quick we gather some firewood ah, everything's gonna be fine <laughs> Kokiba. okay I'm gonna stop filming and hurry up <laughs> so we reached the lake I'm not sure I'm gonna go down there it's not like there's gonna be a beach and the rain is coming <laughs> now so I'm gonna set up the tarp maybe up here hey Kiva stop now yeah we just need a lake for to gather some water and to look at when we're <laughs> when we're bored so it's a common problem that I have <laughs> every time. It's raining, so I should get my tarp up. But I'm indecisive where it's gonna be. I've been standing here for, since I was sitting here saying that I'm gonna hurry, I've been standing here for like 15 minutes at least. Just looking at like, oh, should it be this tree or this tree? And in the end it doesn't really matter because it's never perfect. I don't think that's what I'm looking for. It's just that I can't decide. The lake is over there. If I stand up I can see it. That's good enough. <laughs> we could be closer. There are no good spots over there. Here there are good tent spots. But I don't want to make a fire on the moss. I want to find something like... Hey, it feels like I'm ruining it. You know, something like this. But a bigger hole. So it's... Yeah, you're allowed to make fires here, but... Uh, anyways... I'm just gonna set it up. It doesn't matter where it is. Right? Yeah, but I know I want to make it here. Because you can see Kiba. Oi, I didn't mean to call you, sorry. But she just likes those spots where she can see everything. So I want to be here. Yeah, okay, the tarp. <laughs> now we're... Uh, okay, so yeah. I didn't do at all what I said I was gonna do. We went down to the lake and it's worth it. Yeah, this feels much better. Here we can make a fire. It was too pretty up there. <laughs> huh? Yeah, now we're gonna hang out here for 20 minutes thinking about where to set up the tent. But I wanna have it where the fire is, or do I? Maybe I have enough holes in my tarp from fires. Looks like a campsite over there. Yeah, okay, so <laughs> a real campsite spotted. I guess some more not a real campsite someone has used it there's a fireplace there's a bench <laughs> homemade I think it's hunters yeah this is not a trail like if you look at the map nothing leads to this lake but I saw some I don't know what it's called but some orange like hunting markers if we move, it would be the last time. <laughs> yeah, I liked it over there. Let, uh, let's go over there. I'm gonna show. Oh, oh, yeah. yeah, nothing's gonna beat this. This is where we set up. And we're not gonna even think about it. It's gonna be here. We can look at the lake. Everybody's happy. We're not moving again. Whatever happens. <laughs> Sometimes it's good to move and not settle for whatever you have. It's much nicer to sit down at the lake. We can have a fire, cook our food. 
Oh, if we find some dry firewood. I saw there was some stash there, but I'm not gonna touch it. If there's someone who has actually stashed it for themselves. And I'm not gonna use it and replace it. Because I would probably replace it with like the worst wood this experienced hunter would want. They would look at it and like, who the hell did this? So I'm not gonna touch it. <laughs> Okay, we got fire, we got sun, and we got rain. <laughs> the weather today has been confusing. I was about to show the tent and stuff in the sun, <laughs> and then all of a sudden it started to, to rain. Oh shit, I guess at one point, It's just gonna be rain, no sun, and uh, no fire. <laughs> so I'm gonna hurry up. I'm gonna do breakfast and uh, dinner all at once. <laughs> I had some nuts while we were walking, but that's pretty much it. Ah. <laughs> I like the weather, it's perfect, what a nice spot, whoever did this, thank you, I, I got my own wood. So don't you worry about that. Oh. Huh? I told you, next time we'll be spring camping. This is as much spring as it gets. <sighs> oh, breakfast. Yeah. It was actually hard walking through that through the forest. It looks easy. Like up by the moss. It's pretty flat. And there's not much like bushes and stuff. But the moss <laughs> you get a good grip on the moss but under it it you just slide. Because it's been raining, it's wet. So it's very slippery. I almost slipped many times, so I'm happy we got off the most. <laughs> so I'm just gonna cook my dinner now as well. So for the first time, maybe I don't have to <laughs> fumble around in the darkness <laughs> as I always do. I brought something very easy as well. We're making burgers, but with halloumi cheese. And I didn't bring any dressing. I don't want to bring like a can of dressing. And I, I just passed the store and I thought, what makes a burger like wet, <laughs> juicy dressing like without dressing? So I got tomato and then I got cheese. Ah, oh, cheese. It's like dressing, kind of. But I forgot that I was making it with cheese. So now it's going to be cheese on cheese. It's too much cheese, even for me. Right. Can't go wrong. They just need to get warm. Some surface that looks 
like you want to eat it. We turned them around. The halloumi. And we slap this on top. This is probably gonna ruin everything. I don't even like this kind of cheese. It's not cheese. <laughs> it's plastic in plastic. But I think it's gonna be pretty dry. Well, let's just have low expectations. Right? That makes everything good. Let's consider him done. <laughs> Smoky. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't bring anything that would require effort cooking. Because <laughs> sometimes I, I miss I miss this because I'm busy like cooking and doing stuff. So I miss just sitting down and <laughs> relaxing, <laughs> I guess. Even though I like to. Wow. I like to spend you know, some extra effort into cooking because I would never or like you're never gonna see me bring out one of these like freeze dried pre meals that you can buy and pour water into them and I oh. like then why am I here if I'm gonna eat that, you know? Even if I went on a long hike, there's no way. I know it's for the weight, but that's not gonna happen. <laughs> if I make it myself, sure. I think it would kinda ruin the whole experience. Well, if you don't care about the food, then sure. I guess. But I think eating is, you know, such a big part of being out here. Uh-oh. What? Did I catch you relaxing? Hello. It's okay. <laughs> Lay down. Take it easy. Hey, Kiba, come. Hey. Sit. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. It's okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we can take a quick look at the tent and tarp. This, <laughs> it works now, setting it up with a small rock. But this is very dangerous, what I've done. I've seen it before, like, yeah, it's great, perfect. But if the wind picks up, 
this rock can go flying if it catches the tarp, the wind. Uh, so if if I use a rock, I need to make sure that it's a big rock and it's not gonna go flying, because this is very dangerous. I've seen it go just shoo, flying right at the tent before. So this is just for now. There's no wind, but I'm gonna go look for. Huh? You're eating trash. Okay. Kiba was eating the trash. <laughs> mm, yeah, so now before I go in there, I'm gonna go and look for a solid big rock uh, to make sure. Yeah, because that's dangerous if the wind picks up during the night. And I don't have any poles because under here there's no dirt, it's just rock everywhere. It's the same up on the where all the moss was. It's just uh, solid rock everywhere. So that's why I've been using. Yeah, so this is my go-to, like in the summer, mesh tent. Because, <laughs> you wanna go inside and lay down? Yeah, cause it's pretty light. It was the first thing that I bought when I thought that, oh, I'm going light. <laughs> uh, but it turns out it's not super light, but it's okay. Yeah, you're supposed to, of course, you know, pin this, like you get more rooms if you pin the edges. But uh, <laughs> sometimes I get lazy. I don't think I need it. I didn't even bring the pins, so. Yeah, it, it feels like uh, you're actually sleeping outside, like instead of a tent. But the main reason was Kiba, because she does not like tents. So now she can sit inside here and she can see everything, <laughs> which uh, is great because now she doesn't complain. In a tent, she complains a bit because in the tent, she's just sitting all night, just sitting up and listening because she can't see out. So she's just listening and she looks so intense. <laughs> like you can see how hard she's just listening for her stuff. Yeah, yeah, I don't think it's good for her, but she is stressing me out with that because <laughs> she looks so intense. So now she can sit in here, she can listen, she can see 360 around and yeah, we're both happy about that. And she's not going to run around and also she doesn't have to deal with any bugs. It's pretty tricky to get it like, <sighs> okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, how do I show it? To not get like... You bring it out, but it will still be like this. It needs to be perfect, like all the edges. And with Kiba, for example, yeah, she messes up the lines all the time <laughs> with the leash and doing stuff like this. So, yeah, I don't, I don't really bother making it perfect. I set it up, and but what I would want is just something here, like there's, there's small like things here. I can put something on myself I guess. Yeah, so what they should have done, I think, one of these is put them on the sides here. Yeah, is put them on the sides like this so I can either tie it to like my tarp stuff and or whatever. I can pull it out without making the edges perfect because it goes down anyways. Yeah. Who cares? It's good enough. So far, this has been a perfect trip. I haven't seen or heard anyone. There are no bugs. The sun has been out. It's been raining. It's been hailing. I, I didn't have any trouble with the fire. I don't know why. Maybe we're improving. Because it's, it's still wet wood. And it's burning. Like gasoline. I'm gonna have another cup of coffee. Then I'm gonna go to bed. Oh, it's only 6.20. 
maybe I'll go to bed anyways. I might just cut it here and enjoy the rest of the night for myself. <laughs> for once. Okay, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.